what do small market teams like the A's or the Rays or the Pirates look like in, in five years or in 10 years? Because at a certain point, can the A's just start running out of things to exploit? And do, you know, do the Rays just like, we, we can't gamble anymore. Like, you know, we've, we just can't compete with the teams that, you know, can spend the money on more assured talent. Like, what does this look like in the long term? Yeah, I mean, I think, yeah, anytime you talk about risk reward, like at some point you run out of opportunities. And again, when you don't have the resources to cover up mistakes, you know, that's, I can remember years ago, and, and you have to be a little bit older and a real baseball junkie to remember this, but I remember when Steve Carsey signed a big contract with the Yankees. He signed like four years, 16 million, which at the time for like a middle reliever was like gobs and gobs and gobs of money. And he wasn't going to be a closer. They had Rivera there still at the time. He was purely a middle reliever and they were dropping four minutes and he sucked. I mean, he just, he just didn't do anything. His skills didn't translate. He, I don't know if he cracked under the pressure in New York, like a lot of guys do, but, but they could afford to move on. Like the A's can't afford to make those mistakes. For example, they signed their one long-term deal that they've signed over the, over, over the two really that they've signed over the course of the last like 10, 15 years was Eric Chavez, who like didn't really pan out. And then Chris Davis recently, who they actually paid pretty good money to also didn't pan out. And you just, if you're in that situation, those single mistakes can be totally crippling. So at some point, those teams make those kinds of mistakes and either get, you know, bad luck with injuries or players that underperform for whatever reason. I know Chavez was like a big injury guy, had major back problems and whatever else, but you just can't afford to cover up those mistakes. Or it's like the Yankees wasting 16 million on Steve Carsey was like, Who's Steve yeah. Carsey? Pennies. Yeah. 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 I think that's that's an interesting point that these small market teams have such a small margin for error, right? I mean, one miss and you're screwed potentially for the next four, five, six years. And and any ability to reach in the purse strings and make another move is basically is gone at that point. And the one the one memory I have of Eric Chavez growing up around here in that era and going to a lot of A's games in that era is him swinging and missing at high fastballs for some reason. That image will not leave my mind. 